All right, so you guys are probably wondering, why am I outside of Frag Lab? Because it's a different revelation. Oh, well, guys, I am outside of Frag Lab right now is because I was watching a TikTok. I think it was a TikTok or a YouTube short. And it was something where a guy had a jar of Vaseline and he sprayed his fragrance inside of the jar of Vaseline and it's supposed to last longer now i've heard of the whole thing of putting vaseline on first and then putting your spraying your fragrance on but what i'm going to do is i'm doing an experiment today guys so i am actually going to go to the store get me a jar of vaseline a small jar and i think i'm gonna try it out with two fragrances that i feel like that needs a little bit of work on longevity and i personally like them actually so it is my time for noir extreme and my YSL myself. So I don't know which one I'm gonna use, but it's gonna be one of the two. Hopefully the music in the background isn't, you know, bothering this video, but it's gonna be one of these two. And I'm gonna take you guys step by step. So let's get to it. All right, guys, we are now at the Red Circle Boutique and the personal care aisle. For those who don't know what the Red Circle Boutique is, that is Target. Go all the way to the back, guys. Uh, go to the travel size. You will find the Vaseline jars for $1.79. Very inexpensive. Shout out to my kicks. We got the retro ones on, Christmas colors. You can't. All right, lose. guys, I made a quick run to Target and I went and grabbed these two uh, smaller size Vaselines. Make sure you guys go to the back. Go to the back, get it for like $1.79. Get the cheapest one you can find, but this is the 1.75 ounce in case if you guys are interested. Um, I am boiling water right here, so try not to get too close, but I'm boiling water. I'm gonna let it simmer, do what it needs to do. Then once it stops boiling, I'll take it off the eye, put it over to the side, and then just let it sit in there for a minute until it mushes up and we'll check back in after that. All right, so here is the aftermath of letting the water boil pouring it in a separate bowl and just letting the Vaseline sit in there. I did not boil the Vaseline and the water together. And by the way, this stinks to high heaven. After results, as you can see, where it's starting to become liquid form. This is perfect time for us to be able to go ahead and mix this stuff up. I've got two spoons right next to me. Um, yeah, look at the liquid just moving over to the side. But I've got my two spoons. I've got my two fragrances that I'm gonna mix. We're going to do a 10 apiece. Before you guys even start, man, I have my beater shirt on. I'm, I'm mixing Vaseline, playing with fragrances. I need no stains and I'm in a comfort in my home. <laughs> so after I wipe these down, I'm gonna throw these in the refrigerator and I'm probably gonna put them in there for about 24 hours. And yes, I'm obviously having fun with the experiment at the time. <laughs> all right guys so i am back in the frag lab this is the second day and this is going to be my last day conducting this experiment with this vaseline uh fragrance and vaseline jars i have both of them here and i will say first and foremost if you guys uh paid attention to me actually mixing the spoons i used two different spoons with this experiment i laid them on the counter and i can still tell two days later that both of those fragrances are on the spoons now it's very faint but I could tell it it's on there. The first day that I went ahead and put the Vaseline on my hand, or rather on my wrist, because I know I was gonna be washing my hands throughout the day. Um, I wanna say that it lasted about maybe three to four hours. It wasn't what I initially thought. I thought this was supposed to last all day, maybe as a substitution, or maybe I was silly of me, but three to four hours from both of these. And what I've noticed, even with these Vaseline jars now, guys, I can still smell I can still smell the Tom Ford in the background on this one, and I can still smell the YSL myself. But with the YSL myself, it seems like more of an alcohol concentration than this Tom Ford. Now, when I first went into this experiment, I wanted to use linear fragrances and linear fragrances that I felt that really needed some help in a performance category. What personally worked for me along with this experiment, what I discovered is when I actually use the Vaseline, my hand is shimmery right here so maybe i should use the other one i have vaseline all over my hands and also guys i've seen somewhere where someone was saying don't put it on your lips absolutely do let's have common sense when doing this experiment guys do not use your freaking do not put this on your lips do not put this anywhere that can cause health issues don't don't do that 
But what I did was I went ahead and put the Vaseline on. As a matter of fact, let me get a little bit more. What I did was I put the Vaseline on and you're going to be shimmery for a second. Just get over that fact for a second. But I put like a thin coat. I think this is an awesome way for this to last. If you use this as a thin coat and then you spray on top of the layering. What I've noticed on second day is that this lasted for quite a bit of time, guys. I want to say at least got about six plus hours, maybe even seven, you know, just by doing it that way. So the Vaseline trick does work. It does work, but it doesn't work the way that I originally anticipated. I think if you go ahead and put your sprays inside of the Vaseline, I don't know how long that this particularly lasts inside the Vaseline jar, but if you use your Vaseline, we'll put the sprays inside the Vaseline in the jar, refrigerate it, and let it go ahead and settle in. I think that this will be a dope base coat to use along with spraying your fragrances. So hopefully that makes sense for a dollar and 79 cents for this Vaseline jar. You're not really wasting too much money. And heck, for about seven to 10 sprays, guys, you'll be perfectly fine. So I think this is worth trying out. Um, it's helping me so far, but this is only the second day too. So in my opinion, I think this is a dope idea. Just needs to be executed just a tad bit different. So that's just my two cents. Hopefully you guys like this experiment. And I'm going to go ahead and get out of here for the day. As you guys have been rocking with Mills and Fragrant really locked. I'll catch you guys next time. If you like today's content, make sure that you guys do hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys next time. All right. Peace. Thank you.